Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another Army Acquired tutorial. This is going to be a quick tip. How do we paint in areas or use an attribute to drive what area of vellum is activated? So I downloaded this model from Scan the World. I am going to basically just import that model so that we can test it out on that model. So I'm going to do assets and already bring it in. All right, I'm gonna set it up and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. Basically, just set it up and reduce the um, the polygons. So let's uh, paint in an orange. First, we need to uh, make sure that a color attribute exists. So I'm just gonna drop a white color, and then I am gonna do a sphere and drive the infection area based on the sphere. So we want the sphere to be black. Um, Right, so and then we'll do an attribute transfer and transfer the color from this sphere onto there. And this is just a way that I like for transferring color from one thing to another. To another. All right, uh, so let's uh, let's see somewhere here. And I actually let's just make the statue just a little bit bigger. And say, for example, she is really tired and her arms, um, well, let's see first. Let's just infect the bottom area. So I, I like to use this technique. You could literally just paint. It's basically just transferring it's basically just uh, you just want to have the, the statue painted, all right? So, vellum, vellum plot. And uh, we want to do vellum solver. And we want the color to drive the mass. So, let's just drop a wrangle. Let's say add mass is equal to add CV. So what happens when we hit play? See only the top part is gonna receive vellum. And it's pretty cool. Now, this is value of one, this is a value of one, this is a value of zero. We could get in between levels if we had like a little bit of a gradient, uh, like a blend here. Let me just show you guys. So see like now the bottom part is also being infected. Uh, uh, like, uh, but it's just a little bit stiffer. The top part is obviously gonna be way less. All right, guys, I hope you guys like this tip um, and um, I'll be back with more.